My Pet Monster was created in 1986 by American Greetings as a plush doll geared towards boys. Being the fact that there was not many toys geared toward boys during 1986, the toys sold very well. The monster was a furry blue plush doll with horns and a fang smile that came with toy chains which could be worn by the child or by the monster. In addition, the monster came with a key as well to unlock the links. With the popularity of the plush doll in the late 80s and early 90s came merchandise such as coloring books, puzzles, and more. In 1986, during its release, a live-action direct-to-video movie was released in which a boy named Mac goes on a school field trip to a museum. While in the museum, Max discovers a statue of the monster, which somehow turns him into the monster himself, but only when he is hungry. While that is going on, Max is being hunted by a historian named Snyder, who discovered the statues originally and wants to expose Max for publicity purposes. Not only was there a film, but also an animated series that lasted one season as well. The animated series was a 13-episode series which featured Monster, also nicknamed Monzi, who lives with a boy named Max who concealed Monster's secret from everyone except his sister Jill and his best friend Chucky. To help keep his secret safe, Max has handcuffs for Monster, which turns Monster into a stuffed animal instead of his live Monster self. Of course, if that wasn't bad enough, Max and Monster have to deal with the neighbor Mr. Hinkle and their dog, whom always assumes that Max is up to no good, as well as Beastor, who is a villainous monster who is huge and comes from the monster land, determined to take Monster back. Beastor hated sunlight, thus he wore shades to protect himself from its bright light. Although menacing in nature, Beastor always failed to capture Monzi as he could be stopped merely by the cuff which would turn him into a much smaller version of himself, or he would often get sent back through the portal in which he came from. Nowadays you can find new throwback My Pet Monster figures courtesy of Super 7 and other merch from various others. As for the animated series, it is available as a complete series on DVD. However, if you are looking for the live action film, I'm afraid to say it has yet to be released on any format but VHS. That's all for this episode. As always, click the bell to get notified, subscribe, and like. And as always, stay scared.